This is a Fox News alert despite all the prognosticators predicting otherwise and a potential indictment. One of President Trump's closest allies is hanging tough in an epic re-election fight in Israel. Let's go straight to Chief Correspondent Jonathan Hunt watching the vote count in the early morning in Jerusalem. Hi, Jonathan. <laughs> Hey, Shannon, in the head-to-head -head battle between Benjamin Netanyahu's Likud party and the blue-white party of his chief challenger, Benny Gantz, honors are pretty much close to even at this point. But the Israeli system forces parties to form a coalition government. And the early indications, all of them that we're getting right now, are that Prime Minister Netanyahu is certainly best placed to form a government governing coalition and therefore win another term. I was very moved that the nation of Israel once again entrusted me for the fifth time and an even greater trust. I am telling you, it again gave trust for us and for me. It's unprecedented. Now, if Netanyahu does succeed in putting together a workable coalition, it's likely to tilt strongly to the right. And some of his coalition partners will be pushing him to fulfill his pre-election pledge to annex Jewish settlements in the West Bank, a move that would effectively kill off the prospects for a Palestinian state. But former Israeli Defense Forces Chief of Staff Benny Gantz and supporters of his centrist blue-white party are not conceding defeat yet, in fact, quite the opposite. In elections, there are losers. In elections, there are winners. And we are the winners. Now, the focus for Gantz and his party, if they are excluded from government, will be keeping the pressure on Netanyahu, in particular over the potential corruption charges the prime minister faces. Now, a hearing on those charges, Shannon, is due within months. And as long as those charges are out there, Israeli politics will remain clouded by uncertainty. So while in the literal sense there is a new dawn right behind me here in Jerusalem, Jerusalem, in a political sense, very little has changed here in Israel. Shannon? All right. Thanks for working the early shift for us, Jonathan. Great to see you.